Hi everyone, my name is Wang Yue Xu. Today, I'm so glad to give you a presentation of paper Fast Evaluation for Relevant Quantities of Opinion Dynamics. This is my presentation outline. Online social networks and social media are increasingly becoming an important part of our lives. People share and shape opinions here in the the online virtual world. Polarization, disagreement, conflict, and controversy. These phenomena only took place in real human societies before, but now they are more apparent online. Thus, it is interesting and significant to investigate and quantify the real social phenomena in opinion formation. There are two main questions to be solved in this paper. The first is to quantify those phenomena in a proper way. The other is to calculate them first and currently. This slide briefly shows some basic concepts about undirected weighted graph and its related matrices. We can see the definition of the notations for degree matrix, weighted agency matrix, age weight matrix, Laplacian matrix and age node incidence matrix and other forest matrix. Here gives two social opinion dynamics models. They are the Groot model and the Fredkin Johnson model. Since Fredkin Johnson model is an important extension from the Groot model, their features and the difference are listed in this table. The Groot model was proposed in 1974. It is a simple model but can depict the opinion formation and the communication. Individual in this model has only one opinion. It updates to a weighted average of its neighbor's opinions. While in F. Fredkin Johnson model, we also call it F3 model. Everyone has two opinions. One is internal opinion and the other is express opinion. People whose is internal opinion is mine but shows expressed opinion to others. At the beginning of the opinion dynamics, the expressed opinion equals to the internal opinion. Along with communication, one is influenced by his neighbors and change his expressed opinion. In FG mode, people insist to his internal opinion to some extent. His opinion evolves as a weighted average of its corresponding internal opinion and the expressed opinions of his neighbors. The update equation quite different to the left degree opinion. We can find this FG model seems accord to reality more. Our work is based on FG model. We investigate the expressed opinion of the who at equilibrium. Z is the equi expressed opinion vector, and we find that the equilibrium expressed opinion for every node is determined by the force matrix. Since the force matrix is a doubly stochastic matrix, that is the row sum and the column sum of the matrix are both 1. The total expressed opinion is equal to the total internal opinion. Although the expressed opinion in equilibrium for a single node may be different from its internal opinion. In the FG model, the opinions of, of, of nodes often cannot reach consensus. There are conflict, disagreement, polarization, and controversy, such as our real human society. In opinion models, we need to survey some quantitative merits of this phenomenon. As we all know, in the FG model, individuals differ in, his, in, the, in their internal opinions and expressed opinions. The extent of this difference can be measured by internal conflict. It can be calculated by the sum of the squares of the differences between internal and expressed opinions 
over all knows. The difference between external opinions for each pair is measured by disagreement, calculated by the sum of squares of the differences between expressed opinions over all connected node pairs. The disagreement is also called the external conflict. The stress of a node can be measured by the sum of its internal and external conflict. If the equilibrium expressed opinions have an increased divergence, we see that opinion formation dynamics are polarizing. Polarization measures equilibrium expressed opinion diverge from their average. A similar definition is called a controversy. It quantifies how much the expressed opinion varies across the individuals in the whole graph. Controversy is calculated by the sum of the squares of the, the equilibrium expressed opinions. We can find that the controversy is n times of polarization. Let the sum of disagreement and controversy be the disagreement controversy index. It is easy to verify this index is equal to the inner product between internal opinion vector and expressed opinion vector. We express the quantities in terms of quadruc forms because the equilibrium expressed opinion can be calculated by our forest matrix. We establish a connection between forest matrix and these k quantities. We can see the matrix forms of these quantities. So calculating these quantities will with the help of calculating the, the inverse of forest matrix. However, exactly inverting forest matrix takes cube, cubic time and there are abundant matrix inversions and uh, multiplications in the whole calculated process. It is cal computationally impractical for large graphs. Thus, we need to make it easy to avoid matrix inverting and appropriate to those social graphs with millions of nodes. Next, we press represent these quantities in terms of the L2 norm first, then provide an algorithm to uh, approximate these quantities in nearly linear time with the age number. Implement it on some real network data sets. We give the, the L2 norms of internal conflict, disagreement, polarization, and controversy, and disagreement controversy index. Their forms are similar, and we try to approximate them in the next steps. Here is the nearly linear time solver. There are four parameters. T is an n times n positive semi-definite matrix with m non-zero interest, interests. X is a column vector. Delta is an occurrence parameter. Y is a column vector written from the solver. By using this solver, we obtain a vector to approximate the, the express opinion with a theoretically guaranteed error delta. The expressed uh, time is nearly linear time with the age number. We also use epsilon approximation to give uh, an upper bound of I plus L by using the maximum age weight in the graph. Using the nearly linear time solver and epsilon approximation, we give three lemmas to prove theoretical guarantee errors for our approximation algorithm. 
these returned values can be parts of the quantities we have analyzed in the L2 norm of those quantities. This is the pseudo code of our approximation algorithm named approxim. It can return the approximate values of internal conflict, disagreement, polarization, controversy, and the disagreement controversy index. Next, we will show our experiment results. We can see in this table, we compare the running time of our approximate algorithm with the exact algorithm. The, the internal opinions are generated according to three different distributions, uniform distribution, exponential distribution, and the power law distribution. For large networks with more than 10,000 nodes, exact algorithm is much slower than the approximate algorithm. For example, for this network, the running time of, for approximate is much less than 100, 100 of that for the exact. Due to the high memory and the time cost, the exact algorithm fails to run for those algorithm graphs with over 150,000 nodes. Our algorithm shows a very obvious efficiency advantage. Our approximation algorithm has also high occurrence. This table shows the, the approximate results of our approximate with the exact result of the exact. Which are the mean relative errors of the four estimated quantities? Internal conflict, disagreement, polarization, and controversy. We can find that the actual relative errors can be ignorable. All errors are less than 10 to the negative seventh power, much smaller than the proved theoretical guarantee. Finally, we list the advantages of our approximate algorithm. Our approximate algorithm is based on the Laplacian solver for solving linear system of equations can avoid the operation of matrix inversion. The algorithm has an almost linear computation complexity with respect to the number of edges in the graph. It also simultaneously processes a theoretical guarantee for a currency. The error is much smaller than the proved theoretical guarantee in practice. So that's all. Thank you.